When NASCAR dropped the checkered flag on the Enjoy Illinois 300, it wrapped up a weekend that was more than 55 years in the making for race fans in and around St. Louis. As five on your sides, Holden Kerwicki quickly found out, fans are already excited about what the future holds. They started lining up hours before the flag dropped. We came in about 10 o'clock this morning. For NASCAR's first ever pit stop in the Metro East. Everybody's a rookie this year, right? In the action on the track. I just want to like listen to the noise. Pet race fans like Marty David all revved up. I mean, it's great. It's a short enough track you can see basically the whole race, so that's great. And then, like I said, again, we got the best seats in the house. First time race fans left blown away by more than the action on the track. Everyone is so funny. Uh, this is my first NASCAR, and I mean, the people, the vendors, everyone had a beautiful time so far. Got a good showing, a lot of, lot of fans, so it's good for the area. While well, the wait for concessions 35, 40 minutes may have left fans wishing they could step on the gas. Uh, I need to bring a grill. <laughs> Better. That didn't stop anyone from trying to convince NASCAR to make this a permanent stop. They can't go anywhere else if they don't stop here. This is a great track. It's it's perfect size for NASCAR. Uh, I think, yeah, it's got to be every year now. Plan to come out like months and months and months a year ahead of time. It's worth it. Of course, it's the action on the track that's going to keep the fans and NASCAR coming back. Hannah and Corey will have more on the race coming up in sports. Reporting at Worldwide Technology Raceway, Holden Kerwicki, five on your side.